Hey guys, welcome to my home. Welcome to the Cole Sprouse hair tutorial, which I've been promising you. Here it is, guys. Take it to your hairstylist if you want Cole's hair. Your hairstylist should be able to recreate this. Now in the video, Cole's hair is a little bit short on the side, so he came to me with that, and what he wanted was to blend it back into his Jughead character. So we needed to start growing it back out. His hair was short, but I made it a little shorter and grew it out, okay? So anyway, watch what follows and I hope you really enjoy this. So what I do first is I'm coming all the head back so that I can connect the top section in the back and the sides to the shortest area of the hair. And notice how I'm keeping it out on an angle, but cutting it vertically and bringing all the hair back on the sides all the way back. Now I go around the other side and I'm cutting the back, doing the same thing, connecting the back to the shortest lengths and I'm combing all the hair out of the way, all the long hair, because I want to have a little bit of disconnection. I'm doing the same thing on the other side as what I did, and now I'm combing it all back. And I like to comb it back because I want to connect all those front long lengths into the back. So if he was to comb his hair back, that it all blends in smoothly. I'm still connecting the back section, and I'm bringing the longest length all the way back. And then I chip in, I don't cut a straight line, I chip into it. So here you can see I'm chip, 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 and I just, I point the scissors into the hair and I chip it away at it. Overextending the hair all the way back so that, see how I drag it back? Um, that makes the front a little bit longer. So it's still connecting on the top and I'm connecting it all the way to the back section as well and bringing everything all the way up and that way when it falls down, it has a little bit of a layered look. Now what I'm doing is scissor over combing the sides and the back and blending that all in and scissor and point cutting. And I'm just cutting off the little bits that are sticking out, but I'm still leaving the front disconnected. See how that long piece is on the sides? What I'm doing is just blending those sides so that when he combs his hair back, he has a really sharp um, square cut through the sides. I leave a little bit of weight on the sides so it really has a nice graduated effect. Now I'm using my FHI 1900 Chrome Dryer. I love that dryer. I actually gave Cole one of those. You can get those with uh, my code Sean30 and uh, get 30% off at the FHI Heat website. I'm going in with my trimmers and I'm just going in and just cleaning up any uh, little hairs that might have stuck out. And I go back in once it's dry and I just check the ends and now I'm using my thinning shears and I take some of the weight out of the end so it doesn't sit too thick. I use a little bit of paste. Um, I put a little bit of Neobond in his hair, which is this cool product that's like a treatment. Um, you can get that at fhiheat.com. Now I'm using a little bit of cream from, it's a cream elixir right there, and uh, I'm just trying to get Cole's hair back into really good condition. And there you go. Thanks for watching. Please like and share and tell your friends about it. Okay, thank you. Bye guys.